Yeah, Carla and Rick, it's an ongoing search and rescue effort here behind me. Take a look. You can see a lot of fire and rescue teams here. Uh, the city of Birmingham just sent in their heavy rescue uh, crew here to try to get this man. We're told that he is trapped under several trees in his home. A lot of neighbors standing by, as you can imagine, very concerned about this man who they have not been able to get out of his home as of yet. Now, this is Likes Boulevard. As you mentioned, we have damage up and down this street. You can see power lines down, trees down, debris scattered all over yards. Even here at one of the homes, you can see that a roof was just ripped off the home. Uh, one tree right here in the middle of the yard, very large tree, completely uprooted from the ground. That just shows you how powerful this storm was that moved through here late last night. Uh, we've seen a lot of people walking up and down this street, uh, just very shaken over the events that happened uh, in the overnight hours. Now here uh, here on Likes Boulevard, we have probably a, a dozen or more fire and rescue crews, many of them from neighboring cities. We mentioned the city of Birmingham here. We also have uh, the city of Warrior. We also have uh, crews from Moody, St. Clair County. So a lot of people coming in to assist the city of Fultondale. Obviously, this is much more than they can even handle. But again, right here behind me, an ongoing search and rescue effort. Uh, a gentleman trapped inside his home from that storm that came through here. They're working to get him out. Uh, they haven't been able to get him out as of yet, but they do tell me they've been searching all the other homes on this street. Everyone else appears to be OK. This is an ongoing situation, though. Search and rescue efforts underway will continue to keep you updated. Back to you in the studio.